first night that we were in Nashville, walked around the area, and we were like little children when we saw these lightning bugs. Do you know them? You know them? Right. So I saw this little spark in the corner of my eye, and I was wondering what that was. And I looked again, and there were more. And then there were just so many of them. And we were like children delighted to see these little bugs. And it reminded me of a story about uh, glowworms that were traveling along on a branch. Mom and her little tiny tots in tow behind her. And as they were traveling, they were singing, and they, they were glowing, and they were very happy. And then there came a moment where mom said, shh, shh, whatever you do, in the next little while, do not glow. Do not glow, because there's an owl flying around. And if you glow, then we'll be in trouble. So shh. So they travel along very gently and quietly, and suddenly she sees this bright light behind her. She looks around and says, Johnny, what are you doing? I told you not to glow. And Johnny goes, and I'm, I'm, I'm so sorry, Mommy, but when you've got to glow, you've got to glow. <laughs> <laughs> well, friends, when you've got to glow, you've got to glow. And when God calls, you've got to go. And so that's what's happened to many of us in Africa Upper Room. Roland Rink, 2002. He got this clear calling, everyone in Africa, to have an appointment with God every day, mm. with this little book, this tiny little devotional guide. And it has gone from 6,000 copies in the first year to 214,000 copies last year that we are spreading across <laughs> Africa. That's very exciting. And we are all just so blessed to be able to do our own printing in Africa of this little magazine. And tonight, I just ask you, when we get to the time where you offer your tithe and your gifts, that that would be dedicated to Africa Upper Room Ministries. And part of what that would help with is the escalating cost of transporting and distributing the magazines far and wide. They're in different languages in Africa, they're in different countries in Africa, but there's so much more that we'd love to do. In the midst of politics and crime, there's this little bit of hope glimmering. So we're doing a lot in Africa, but your support and prayer would help us do so much more. Thank you so much.